What is going on guys? Sid here with another episode of Spooky Season Specials Spooky Warm-Ups. Guys, we are 81 days away from Halloween. But guys, um I just like I just started browsing like the PlayStation Network and I was like in the in the store, right? I was in the PSN store and guys, I was just like checking out like some Halloween uh, games, Halloween themed games, and I stumbled upon this freaking gem of a game. It's titled Savage Halloween. I don't know if you guys have heard it or not, uh, heard about it or not, but guys, oh my god. This game, guys, you guys are seeing me play this for the first time, and guys, the music is insane. The game was rated a 9 out of 10 on Steam, an 8.5 out of 10 on Xbox Tavern. Guys, I'm just briefly scrolling through all of the reviews but guys just check out the graphics right if you guys are into side scrolling platformers guys this game this game halloween themed game this halloween themed game is absolutely unique it is extremely novel right for the generation that we are in it is a complete blast from the past guys when i tell you this game is well made it's extremely well made and you're seeing my first ever go at this game and guys this game is absolutely insane and guys i think that's the boss right for stage one and um yeah guys uh whew, whew, what a ride this was right like um Oh, wow. Okay, so change weapon L1 and R1, right? I didn't even realize that uh, because, guys, what you're seeing right now is my first ever go at this game. And, guys, if you've ever played the, the old school uh, Sega Genesis games, the Nintendo games, the, the, the side-scrolling um, platformers, fr platformers from uh, that era, guys, this is an absolutely upgraded version of that era, right? brings you back to that generation like no joke when i tell you this game is well made it is absolutely insanely well made from the guns to everything guys the gun selection kind of actually reminds me of like the batman and robin game from uh the sega genesis era right um uh but guys uh like the different weapons the, uh, the different um ammo combinations but also like contra right i, I i'm getting heavy contra vibes but with like this like uh I think I think I think the main character is title uh, his name is James, right? But um, guys, he, he definite definite uh, sk uh, uh like 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 pumpkin head vibes, uh definite definite like uh what's that movie called? Uh trick or treat, right? Uh you remember that that character, right? Uh definitely getting those vibes from uh <laughs> from from this game. But guys, look at the scenery. Look at the scenery for a 2D side scrolling platformer absolutely insane the graphics are unique look at the enemies look at the damn enemies oh my god right uh like i'm just like going through the level as you can see and guys it is it is actually way tougher than it looks but right now like I i'm actually kind of figuring out really right, right, right at this point hmm, this game seems pretty freaking easy right pretty freaking simple right because i'm actually just going through it the health bar is right there and uh i that, that the health icon is right there and my health bar is pretty much unscathed right um kind of made an error there right because i think that box is like breakable but wow wow you can double jump you can you can shoot in all directions right up down side side right uh diagonal right so it gives you a lot of uh, like um there's a lot of play right uh with like directional hits but guys uh check this out right like um okay so what i noticed is that the the, the weapons um the the ammo um the ammo com combinations like the specials like uh the three the, the three the three uh bullet um combo doesn't last too long right but as you can see there i do that nice little drop shot it's so cool to see right um and right now i'm just trying to take out these bats for whatever reason i don't know i could probably just pass them right but um yeah you guys are seeing my first ever go and look you can shoot while you're on the ladder how cool is that right i actually want to try out the other um the 
other characters in the game, right? Because it does give you an option, right, to choose different characters, right? And I didn't even really pay attention to the health bar as of yet, but it actually shows you up top, right? Uh, I have three lives, rem uh, I think, like, three continues remaining. I have three lives remaining as well. Uh, I, I think, I think I'm reading it right. Like, I don't know, I don't know. Like, I, I, don't, I, I don't know. I think it's like three lives and three continues, right? But, um, yeah, we're just... We're breezing past this level, right? These level, uh, like uh, stage one, right? We're breezing past, it, right? These little mini levels, right? And uh, guys, uh, it's 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 looking pretty simplistic, don't you guys think, right? Because look at this, right? It seems pretty straightforward, right? We just have to be patient, and we're just taking these guys out, right? Just like little axe, du little axe dudes, right? Uh, like running around like half semi naked axe dudes, so cool, right? <laughs> Um, yeah, but definitely reminds me of the Trick or Treat character, right? Um, definitely, right? Um, or if you guys have ever seen like the the Billy and Mandy special, um, with with I think Jack the Ripper also has uh, um, Jack also has a pumpkin head as well, right? But any type of pumpkin head vibes, uh, you're gonna get off of this game very easily, right? Uh, definitely, definitely, really, really cool. And we're clearing this level, right? Um really quickly right and uh there's there's this game right uh i don't i, I don't know like if you guys have no look at this look at this look at the look at the look at the weapon look, look look at the ammo right there's 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 ghosts right here that that kind of like give you like a force field right uh believe it or not it is the wildest thing Right, I've seen in quite some time so much creativity in a 2D side-scrolling platformer. And guys, I picked this up for a dollar and forty-nine cents. Can you believe that? One dollar and forty-nine cents, and this game is absolutely insane. What the hell is this game, right? So, uh, fast facts. I'm reading it off right now. Cubite Interactive, right? That's that's the the publisher, um, a developer's second boss. Guys, you guys. Uh, insanely insanely well-made game right so the nintendo switch xbox one ps4 pc and i got it for the ps5 right so it's uh definitely definitely through emulation but guys it's absolutely epic right um so yeah it de like i said contra right and now I'm, I'm like checking out the reviews right now and yeah the first thing that they say contra right so guys look i clear this level like really quickly right and yeah where's I'm just reading this article right now um, on rapidreviewsuk.com, right? Where's my camera? Uh, oh, okay, so they're saying it lacks story kind of, I don't think so. I think it's just, an, it's it's the amount of story that you would expect, right? From, um, I would say it's the amount of story that you would expect from a 2D side-scrolling platformer of the 90s, right? Anywhere from the 80s to the 90s, but definitely the 90s. This is reminiscent of the 80s and 90s, the late 80s and the early 90s, right? This is what you would expect to get. So guys, this kind of like, this is like one of these like, um, this is definitely one of the nostalgia-esque Halloween uh, uh, and spooky season specials episodes, right? Definitely can bring you back to that era of gaming like one, two, three, right? So if you guys ever grew up on the Atari, the NES, the NES, um, the any Nintendo uh, entertainment uh, system console from the past, Sega Dreamcast, Sega CD, Sega Saturn, any of those all had 2D side-scrolling platforms like this. But guys, this is so well made. I think this is one of the best games um, that I just happened to, to, to just find on the PSN. And it is definitely up my alley, being that I am a Halloween buff and a Halloween nut at times. This game is right up my alley. Very, very cool. I am in love with this game. I, guys, you're seeing my first run at this game. And guys, this is like war right now. What what the hell is this stage, <laughs> right? Um, this this like like right at the beginning, right? Um, of stage one, you're thinking you're thinking oh you can get through this stage like you you just breezing past it and it's, you know it's a big pick up and play kind of game, right? Plug and play kind of game, right? That you can just pl uh, turn on turn on your 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 console and then you know you, you can just whisk past levels, guys. That's not the case. When you get to this. Stay this section of the stage. Oh my god, what the hell is this, right? Uh, you have to time your movements quickly, and they come from all angles. I think I messed up here, um, simply because I could have gotten lower, right? To uh, evade the enemies, 
uh, the shots, I could have gotten way lower. But I thought I was like hitting, like I thought I had felt like a hit marker, like I, like on, on my, on my, I felt like I got hit on my health bar when I dropped too low for some reason, right? So I'm definitely gonna give this another go once, uh, once I like, like catch myself because I was not expecting this, right? But now that uh, you know, now that you're, I'm acclimated to the level, I know the next time I turn on this game, I know what I'm going to expect. But guys, this is like something you would see. Like um, this this game is like something you would see, right? Um, me like touch upon, right? For not just for spooky season specials, but definitely for five minute for five minute boss battles because. Five minute boss battle is heavily nostalgia driven, right? But guys, there you see game over, but I have like three continues, right? So I was like, no, 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 no. We're gonna try our best to clear this level, right? Because it's my first go at the game, right? And I'm not expecting, but look at the gun. Look at the gun. I am in no man's land right now. Look at this. And the enemies take a long time to blow up, right? I don't even know if I need to like clear the screen as I am, but look, look, the machine gun, uh, half naked dad bod um i don't know what the hell do you call these guys right and these little ghosts break apart finally i get the gun right and bam i die instantaneously right but here we go again right so i think every time i so i've gotten like uh i have three continues right from game over and i have three lives right um from the game over screen and i have three lives right so you do get you get a lot of lives but they go by very very fast like i think this part this section of the stage kind of absolutely destroyed me look i'm already dead again right but i'm just like yeah let's go let's go I, I, i'm ready i'm ready but this is like some high octane stuff right i think you gotta like douse some like monsters <laughs> like i don't i don't take all that caffeine laden stuff but guys not anymore at least right so um yeah you definitely have to be on a caffeine high to, to play like this level because look at this what the hell you need like some like insanely fast twitch muscle fibers to get get going but guys check this out isn't this wild right like um i'm having such a tough time with this game but i'm trying my hardest i'm trying my hardest right and um oh so now that i'm not playing and i can review as um i can review the what i just went through right uh uh not live i can look at the bar a little closer right and they actually give you they actually give you so you have an expectation of how many uh ghosts that you need to clear off of the stage they give you uh how many bats you have to clear off how many whatever the hell those things are vampire i, I don't know chubby chubby cherubs maybe like uh are these supposed to be like angels like i i don't know like uh little i don't know winged winged demons like i i don't get like uh winged valentine's day demons i have no clue what the hell i'm looking at on the screen but the funniest thing are the dad bod ninjas or yeah like i'm just gonna call them like dad bod ninja angels right like i think i think that's a good descriptor <laughs> right i don't know whatever else to call them but this game is just like taking me by surprise, right? And it's a welcome change from the FIFA 22 content as we wait for FIFA 23, right? Um, yeah, I did not even expect to be like playing this game. I just like happened to like just jump onto the PSN. I'm like, you know what? Uh, are there any other games, right? And I'm still gonna be playing Castlevania as well, right? Like I, I wanna jump into Castlevania and give that another go, right? But what the hell, right? I think I just like, uh, uh, I, I just like stumbled upon like a gem right that I did not expect to find right so we hit the checkpoint we hit the checkpoint right but now I think I picked up like the wrong weapon right because this one's like a laser guided one that if you miss right you're kind of screwed because the reload on the gun is just kind of like crazy but I think it's like a one shot like deal like one shot kill type deal but you have to be extremely accurate with that 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 gun but um yeah i'm not a huge fan not a huge fan of it right because um i think it just wastes too much time but i don't see any other options right um i don't know i don't know uh but definitely that frog weapon that frog weapon that we're coming across that frog icon definitely definitely using that right like um that's a serious one and i had the ghost weapon too right 
and I kind of like lost that one, but I just wanted to see what this frog weapon was, and then I just went back to this one, right? I shouldn't have... I don't know, I don't know. There's so many different types of weapons, right? And you have to really just figure it out. But guys, another game over, so I hit another continue, right? And guys, we are we're 14 minutes into this game, right? And what the hell is stage one, right? Um, when are these enemies going to finish, right? It says I have 232 bats to finish off, right? So I guess it takes you back to the checkpoint where you have to clear all these guys again. But at least I have a better starting weapon, right? Um, because yikes! Because epic yikes right now! I, I, I don't know what else to say. Guys, I just need a breather. I'm gonna take a quick breather because I'm talking the air off right now. But, whew. Look at that. Look at this. Look at look at my screen right now. Look at my screen. Right? At least I have the right weapon. Right? And then I choose the wrong weapon. Right? Uh, not really the wrong weapon. Just not the weapon that you should take. Right? Because of the reload. Right? But then I take this one. Right? And you have to remember, like, the, the ammo on the gun, uh, it doesn't last that long. But guys, here you see me. I drop down again. Right? And I'm, I'm about to die. Right? Like, guys, like, this game is no joke this is definitely contra this is halloween contra like um i did not like 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 it's a bait and switch because at the beginning of stage one you're like oh yeah it's casual casual gaming experience casual gaming experience right but then you see this but guys check this out right i think the marker is incorrect right um because look at the look at the number of ghouls that i have to vanquish but um i vanquished a lot more right but guys check this out right i'm dying again but am I gonna be able to clear this dude, right? I, I don't know his patterns, but I think I'm just getting getting my butt handed to me right now, right? And guys, look at that, right? Like it was the sloppiest, the sloppiest of, and look at that, the, the fat vampire bat or whatever. Like, I don't know if that's like a fat Dracula or whatever the hell that dude is, right? A fat cherub, fat angel, fat whatever, right? Like, I don't know. What the hell do you call this? Guys, help me out. I don't know what the hell this like, like, uh, like, is it, is this like Jabba the Hutt with wings? Like, I don't know. And then there's like baby ghouls and baby demons, all because they're stuck on Earth and they want to rave, they want to party, and they want to take over the world as well, right? But there you have it. Like, I did not memorize this boss's patterns, and bam, he's just sitting on me, right? So definite Jabba the Hutt vibes, guys. This has been Spooky Season Special Spooky Warm Ups, and guys. This was Savage Halloween, and there was nothing short. It was nothing short of Savage. Peace, love, all the blessings to you and your.